What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT and need to get 12 and 0 done, make sure to head up my second sponsor, Rose NBA, on Twitter for a quick, fast, and reliable purchase. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back with another NBA 2K20 MyT video. And guys, today we are going to go over some pretty much empty methods and some empty tips for you guys, market tips and all that good stuff, what you should sell, what you should buy, all that good stuff. Before we get to the video, let's get 100 likes on this video for some empty ways on Twitter. Make sure to get 100 likes on this video, bro. If we get 100 likes on this video over the next three videos, we will do some giveaways on Twitter. We're going to do that regardless. But, yo, it would be greatly appreciated if you could please drop a like and follow my Twitter and Instagram if I am also selling MT. So, on Xbox, if you guys want some MT, as you can see, I have a mill there. I was at two mil. I sold some MT yesterday. So, yo, guys, hit me up if you want MT straight up. Uh, without further ado, man, let's get into some um, market talk and whatnot. We'll pop a pack before we do get into it. And, uh, yeah, so let's pop a pack for this video. And then we'll get right into market talk. Um, honestly, bro, this is Jamal Crawford. Oh, my God, bro. If you guys didn't come to the stream, we missed three Carusos. We missed an Allen Iverson. And we missed two Jamal Crawfords back-to-back. -back. Um, in one hour, we missed seven Opals, six Opals. I don't know. Um, but, yo, the Opal Sniper has been hot. If you guys really want to make MT, if you have patience, I sounded for an hour and I missed seven snipes. Um... I guess it happens. It's the most frustrating thing ever. Missing opal snipes actually sucks. But we got one snipe and it was Caruso, which isn't really a big snipe. Um, it happens, it happens, I guess. Um, if you guys want to sell your cards, it's really not a bad time to do so. In my opinion, it's like you got to sell your cards at this point. I would just really recommend selling your cards because, honestly, what are you waiting for? Um, it's end game, pretty much, bro. 2K is going to continuously drop content and continuously crash the market. And yeah, um, literally, I don't know. One thing I have to tell you guys, if you need help sniping, one of my subs told me, if you go into freestyle, green shot, and go out, your auction will be faster. No joke. It is literally that simple. Like literally go into your freaking freestyle, green a jump shot, leave, go back in your auction. It's 50 times faster. Shout out to whoever said that. I forgot who it was. You're the GOAT. Right now, bro, straight up, I'm honestly sitting on the auction all day sniping for opals. I need opal snipes. I need opal snipes. I need opal snipes. Today, we are going to go over what you guys should sell, what you guys should buy. Personally, I'm going to say this right now. It's a selling day for sure. With Paul George back up to 150, with Opal Caruso back up to 130, with Kareem up to 4, with Bobo up to 4, with Taco up down to 2, like you got to sell. Um, I've been paying attention to all these prices, and honestly, it just reeks of selling. Um, only person who dropped the ton was Oscar Robertson. That was going to happen, like, straight up. And also, if you guys want to lock in Prime 2, it's not a bad idea. Car Garnett is really athletic. But, yo, they just dropped the new and improved Patrick Ewing, which is absolutely sick because he's so good, bro. This Patrick Ewing car is disgusting. And he's athletic. He has an 87 three-point shot. And he's literally the GOAT. So, uh, that card's obviously amazing. I would 100% recommend hopping on the Galaxy Bowl filter. I would recommend hopping on the Pink Diamond filter. Because, yo, filters as of late have been really good. If you guys don't know the Pink Diamond filter, here it is. You gotta stay patient, bro. Honestly, patience is key for sniping. I didn't stay patient. And then, finally, I stayed patient today. I missed so many snipes. Like, I missed... Two Jamal Crawfords on back-to-back -back refreshes. You know how hard that you know how bad I feel right now. I feel like a piece of crap. I missed freaking Jamal Crawford, brand new, bro, brand new card. Sucks to suck, bro. I'm so tight about that. But yo, the Pink Diamond Snipe Filter right now is straight money. Is straight money. So I would 100% recommend you go on that. Some cards I would recommend selling. Um, first off, sell Zion. I have a feeling Zion Flash is coming. I could sniff it, bro. Um, let's see what his price is at. I'm pretty sure he's a buyout too. So I would 110% recommend selling Zion, even though he's a, probably going to be a bid 
But then once the market crashes, bro, goodbye. He's going to be that cheap. He's going to be like freaking 80 KMT. If they drop a Galaxy Opal Zion, he's going to be 50K, 40 KMT. So I would recommend you do so. And also, for all you people that think Kobe's coming to the game, he's not. If you want to sell his diamond, go ahead. You never know when they're going to drop a free Kobe pack. You never know. You never know. So I would 100% recommend selling him while he's this expensive because it is a diamond card. Um, it is a diamond card, so it's up to you, man. Um, right now, another really good snipe filter. I'm gonna blow it up. Yes, I am. Um, Clay Thompson, bro. This snipe filter is being straight money. I actually made like 30k off this in literally a couple minutes. Um, these cards get posted like every second, so like, oh wow. So right there, that one for 21k. I just sold my. Oh, right there, real quick. Right there. So we're going to make a quick 1K profit in one second after the reduction. 1K profit real quick. We're going to throw them up. 1K profit in one second. It's that simple. This filter can make you a ton of MT if you are patient. So just continue to do so. Continue to follow my methods. Clay Thompson, 21.3. Real quick, bang. He's going to sell in one second like my one did yesterday. I saw some for 16K. I saw some for... 15k saw some for 14k and they freaking sell in one second so there you go there's one snipe filter that's obviously money uh the new brandon roy pink diamond i don't know why they would drop a pink diamond brandon roy if he has better stats than the old ball i will freak out i didn't even check his cards out but that card is absolutely like i don't know why they dropped that and they just dropped the pink diamond clay so why they drop a diamond i don't understand it looks like they're running out of cards we need Manu Ginobili back in this game, for real. We need him. We need a Manu Ginobili. These cards are getting posted quickly. I'm just going to raise my bid, hope for the best. But as you can see, man, stuff like this coming out quick, like a 20,500 one, a 20,000 whatever one. They're popping up quick. They're selling quick. This night filter is straight money. And honestly, this is probably one of my best MT making methods for you guys right now. Uh, let's check out Pink Diamond Brandon Roy. See what's going on over there. Just saying. It's always a lot harder to snipe out Pink Diamond, so you might have a lot of troubles with this filter. Um, yeah, he's actually ready to buy out, so you could try out. You might have some fire, fire, fire snipes. Um, he's going to be cheap because the Opal is out. Let's actually compare the stats to the Opal. Um, I believe that you could possibly get him for 40k a couple times. We're going to test out the fields. If the auction stops freaking lagging, dude. Well, guys, so... If you want Galaxy Opal Brandon Roy, here you go. Here's the Pink Diamond. It's the same card. Like, this game is so trash. Like, straight up. That is the most scummy thing ever. Um, This Snipe Filter might be good, bro. Pretty much everything that comes out in new content is going to be money of Snipe Filters. This one obviously takes about 88k. Still. All you people asking for investments. I'm going to be honest. There's no more investments. Like, there's no good investments. Straight up, they destroyed everything. They took away all investments in this game. Oh, wow. Actually, Jahil Okafor and Pasha went up a lot. If you invested in them, that's about it, though. Um, You're going to make, like, 500 MT per pop. That's literally it. Um, The investments are kind of gone. They kind of destroyed those. So I really can't tell you guys that there's a lot of investments going on around the game. I would literally just recommend selling your cards, getting ready to snipe new cards that drop. Because it looks like the new cars that drop are the easiest way to make MT. And investments are pretty much gone. Like, the only ways I could say is if there's cheap diamonds like Jay Williams and Danny Manning. When they first drop, if you pick them up, you're going to make like 1K to 2K later um, the next couple days. So, that was pretty much the last thing I would say that really was investment. Other than that, um, if there's only one diamond card in the collection, you can't really invest if there is two diamond cards oh i missed it no i missed it ah that's an l oh we got it okay that's a little snipe right there um obviously the amethyst filter is still money um just got a body jones for 1k so over 2k made it 800 mt real quick so yeah that's really all i got for the video as you can see my clay did sell so we just made 2k in about two minutes of sniping so if you want to hop on the clay filter if you want to on the ammy filter recommended highly um, let me know how it goes. Just little little tips for you guys. Nothing crazy. Just some market tips and whatnot. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more content. Because honestly, we've been balling out with the content. We've been balling out. We get another 100 subs and all that good stuff. Hope you guys did enjoy. Stay tuned for more content. Peace.